Hey guys, this is Versatile from VST Power, now Halls and Project Phoenix Media. In today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to format your internal hard drive, or in my case, an external hard drive to FAT32. Why would you want to do this? Depending on the application, maybe like for example, PlayStation 3. Back up your data to external hard drive, you have to be FAT32 format, not NTFS. Or maybe you want to use your external hard drive with a modded game console, like a Wii or something like that. So you got to have special file formats, or maybe you have your own particular reasons why you need a FAT32 partition. But let me show you real quick, by default, if you go to my computer here, and depending on your size of your hard drive, like for example, here's my external hard drive, 150 gigabytes. If I try to format it as FAT32 using Windows, I can't do that. NTFS. Uh -uh. That's not what I want to do. So what we're going to do today is go to the More Info section. There's a link to this free program. It's awesome. It's called Mini Tool Partition Wizard Free Edition 9. So download it and install it. And let's go ahead and run that program right now. So here's the program. Launch application. And I'll show you real quickly how to format your hard drive as FAT32. Yes, you will lose your data. So just make sure you back up anything that's important on your hard drive, internal or external back up that data before you proceed with this tutorial. I cannot stress that enough. So right here is a list of all the different partitions and hard drives in my computer. I just happen to know that this right here is my external hard drive that I want to format as FAT32. You must make sure that you are formatting the very correct partition because I am not held liable or responsible if you mess up. So what you want to do is find your hard drive. Here's mine. I'm going to format the whole thing as FAT32. Notice right here it says it's NTFS. So how do you format as FAT32? So that's pretty simple. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click and just go to format. That's the easiest way. You can give it a label name if you want. I'll leave it the same. File system, FAT32. Oh yeah. Cluster size, default. Okay. And then just click on apply. As I say apply pending changes and follow this note here. Say yes. And then you just let it do its thing. Don't do anything else. It's going to go ahead and format your partition properly to FAT32 format. Once you're done, you're good to go. You can rock and roll. You can take it to your PlayStation 3 or your Wii or whatever else you want to do and copy your files over and have a lot of good times. So here it says applied all depending changes successfully. Awesome. My hard drive now is FAT32. Cool. Let's go back to my computer here. And we go back here, right click, go to properties. And it's FAT32, 150 gigabytes, exactly what I wanted it to do. So that is today's video tutorial. You guys have any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.